Well, hey out there, fans, friends, feds, and frenemies, it is I, Postmodern Cowboy, and I'm back with episode number two of Upper Wyvern uh, Going Medieval. Uh, it's a community management survival game from Foxy Voxel. Without further ado, I'm going to get back to the main event here. Where were we? Oh, yeah. Uh, everything was set up. So... We are uh, playing on the Aber Wyvern Seed. We are uh, managing a community which is modeled uh, loosely, loosely on um, the community of Aber Wyvern um, from the 1983 uh, PBS program um, and uh, illustrated uh, kids architecture book uh, entitled Castle. That's by David McCauley. Uh, I encourage you to check it out. Uh, if you've got kids, buy it for them. Um, it's a great read. Uh, totally changed my life. Um, made me love uh, architecture and, and history and buildings and stuff. Um, it's nighttime right now. We'll just, uh, we'll just pass time until the morning. We just survived our first attack. We've got some research available here. Um, I do need to get the, uh, furniture so that we can store our books, uh, ASAP. And, uh, I think the next order of business here is going to be working on the, uh, the cellar. I'll call it the cellar for now. Uh, but in order to do that, we're going to have to dig one level further down. Sleep now. How are we doing on food? Not good on food. Not, not, not good on food. Food reserves in the stockpile are low. Settlers are going to start starving. Um, I don't really know how to resolve that situation right now. Um, it's going to require some, some thought. I got a weapon. Oh, yeah, I guess, I guess everyone's armed. Everyone's armed. I need bows. That's what I need. How do we do this? I might as well just turn this into an enclosed room, right? Like, that, that makes sense? Put, like, a double door there. Oh, I can't because there's a beam in the way. Ah, I'll do that later. Let's keep time going. Is there still a corpse here? There's still a damn corpse here. Right now they can wear light armor. I, uh, I prefer to keep my, my peasants uh, out of their armor um, so that they have the full um, work speed, but we'll deal with that too. Really uh, really what I need is who's my miner right now? No one's mining right now. Okay. I need Andrew to start mining right now. there. How much limestone do I have? Probably a bunch, right? 200 limestone? Yeah, that's great. Okay, so what I have to do here, everybody else is just going to do what they're going to do. Um, actually, I should send uh, Kevin to do hunting. Put animal husband to do two and hauling to three. Catherine to growing and cooking. Yep. Um, and okay, let's make sure we. What, I, what I'm doing here is I'm having him mine back toward the stairs so that uh, I can put stairs down. Um, to the bottom floor, and we're gonna we're actually gonna do the subterranean uh, subterranean level uh, two layers down um, is the plan there. So, mm. 
uh, overview, wildlife. Let's pull up all the deer. Okay, I'll have him hunt the pheasants. I'll have him hunt. I want to keep, uh, oh yeah, so we can, we can safely pop male deer. Um, there is only one adult male deer. That's not good. There aren't, there aren't really any deer. Okay, so he's got to hunt the pheasants. Um, I'll take him off the fox hunt. And I guess there's some wild goats out there. Mature, only mature female goats. Okay, well. Let's hunt the oldest deer. Okay, that should be good. Okay, so when he finishes that, I'll be able to put a flight of stairs down. No, you have to finish, pal. You have to finish before you can take a break. That is it's non-negotiable. I'll have him build that right away. Um, oh, Kevin can't hunt because he doesn't have the bow. Andrew has the bow. See, this is none of bows in my community right now. Um, how do I do this? Andrew will drop his bow. And uh, Lestrange will be coming back to the stockpile anyway. Have him construct. Now he's hunting. Okay. And Andrew, when he comes back, can grab the, uh, I don't know, does he even have melee? He's got a melee of 10, yeah. So he can grab the sword and buckler. That's fine. Nobody cares right now. We're not going to get attacked for at least a little while. Let him build the stairs first. Okay, so we got some mushrooms there. Now I need to expand the subterranean layer. So it's probably actually going to be two wide, um, but I'll work with one layer to begin with. And let's start uh, with a hallway like that. That makes sense to me. Um, and we'll have to go three deep into the rock. Let me just see what the footprint above looks like. Yeah, so it doesn't really matter, eh? Um... This will make it that big for now. Hmm. Really, I just need to put one pillar in the middle of a room like that, don't I? This will be a storage room. I'll do a workshop on the other side. Um, these are these are temporary. Um, you know, this will form like like a wine cellar or something on the finished structure. Um, or underground shelter. But for right now, it's going to save me resources on a room. Andrew, what are you doing? Why are you now constructing? You should be mining. What would he even be constructing? Let's find out. He is. Oh, he's working on. That's not really necessary, but okay. You do that. Meanwhile, Osgar is uh, plugging away at the research bench there. Slowly but surely, we need to get the defensive structures for 30 and smelting for 30. So I need to research 60. Um, he's, he's done six so far, so we'll need a few more days of research at least. There we go. Andrew's mining again. Okay, 
everything's uh, everything's working so far. Let's have Osgar. I know we're good. We're good. Everything's good. Top of trees, doing research when there's no trees to chop, harvesting when things are available to harvest. Speaking of, let's check on that. Um, so there, in fact, are, th oh, my goats just gave birth. This is fantastic. There are things available to harvest. Let's bring in the, uh, the first crop of cabbages. Um, I guess Kevin could also be mining if he's done, if he's done hunting. Has he caught anything? Yeah, it looks like there's a deer on the stockpile now. Uh, two, three, and bring him down to level one mining. She should butcher that deer today. Oh, I wasn't going to harvest these, was I? Oh, oh, right. I wasn't going to harvest these. I was going to let them go to seed um, so that we had a double seed so I could replant next year. If that makes sense. So Oscar goes back to research. Um, both, uh, both Lord Kevin and uh, Andrew Chester are going to do some mining work, I think. And it really is focused on constructing for some reason. I guess he's passionate about it, but, but I want him to stop. I want him to stop that. I'm going to need a fifth community member soon. This is... It's gonna take them a while to clear that out in a day or two at least. So it's it's not uh, it's not dirt. Structurally strong, but I never know with underground rooms in this game whether I should dig out one layer or extra so that I can put walls around it to increase the um, temperature uh, rating and aesthetics of the room. I don't know. I, I feel at this point it doesn't matter, but maybe maybe later in the game I'll I'll do that. Ale has rotted on the stockpile and turned to vinegar. I need Catherine to butcher that deer before it rots. Okay, settlers are starving. We have no food right now. That's not good. That'll make everyone unhappy real fast. She is preparing food as we speak. Okay, everybody's eating. I'm still starving. She hasn't eaten yet, I guess. I'm gonna have Kevin go back to hunting. Okay, so I have um, I have researched 
have them researched preserving food. That's see, I need to I need to do that too right away. I'll wait. That'll be my next my next bit of research. Uh, I'm gonna keep Andrew on mining then. I need the food storage. It's it's complicated. A, a fifth set of hands would really help right now. Everything is as it ought to be. There's snow. And the only thing I could do is cut down in the free time right now to increase the community efficiency. That'll make them less happy. It is what it is, I guess. Yeah, once yeah, once I start to get a little more space in this room, I can I can uh, very soon put food storage there. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna need to put a door here. I think underground spaces are temperature controlled anyway, so long as there's access stairs. But okay, and I need him to mine around the edge of the room first. Like the good, the, oh, my healing kit, this, this, yeah, that, that sucks. That really sucks. <sighs> okay, well, at least we have food. We're not starving. Finish eating, bro. There we go. Okay, Andrew is, why isn't Kevin hunting? Maybe there's nothing for him to hunt right now. He get to the goat. Is that the all those animals are up there? Yeah, they're probably. Oh, they're accessible. Are they far? They're not even that far. Almost eighteen. Yeah, we're almost there. Having food and seed storage and, and medicine storage, like that's going to make a massive difference. Okay. 1920, there we go. So research. Uh, one of my books decayed. Okay. So we've got preserving food now, which means that the number one priority is going to be to drop a couple shelves down here. Um, and I need to put a bookshelf or two in the hall here. I don't know how many books get stored on a bookshelf, but let's just, for now, put three bookshelves there. And I'm going to have Andrew, uh, I'm gonna build the food storage first. And Osgar is on tree chopping duty, so I can designate some trees to turn into wood. Might as well designate these ones too. Get them out of the way. Yeah, Oscar's cutting. Kevin's done hunting. He's come back to do mining. I can also send him to construct. Stuff is just decomposing. Yeah, clothes are harder to store. You need. Okay, you did not just fail at building a damn shelf. What is your construction level? 
18, yeah. This game's, the game's kind of trolling. I think this is uh, difficulty level related failure. And... You can't build the... Make this a food shelf, and then we will right away take all food off that. Um, I should also take uh, seeds and medicine and books off that general stockpile. Those are all going to get moved in short order. I'll have to do like a, a haul session, probably, before these guys go to bed. These are like real rudimentary solutions here, right? Like this is definitely not a permanent part of the build, um, but it's super important to have some place to store your... Uh, okay, and then I'm going to copy... Uh, okay, Andrew, no, you need to now work on a bookshelf. I'm going to copy these settings from one of the shelves, and then that, that shelf won't be food, it'll be... Um, or material, it'll be seeds and medicine. And under seeds, I should probably take all the saplings off. I don't really care about storing saplings right now. I do want to store apple saplings if I, if I happen to get them. Okay. So. No, I want you to haul the books, dude. That's not a complicated order. How many books? You can store a lot of books on one bookshelf. Okay, that's good. That'll prevent my books from decaying because once, you know, I've... Yeah, you can you can actually fall below your allocated uh, number and then you have to re-research things you've already researched because your books decayed. Okay, now we're going to store the seeds. And we'll store the meat. Okay. And then we will actually move the campfire uh, indoors temporarily so that she has immediate access to those things. Um, I'll have Kevin do that. I just have to remember to change the campfire settings again. We do have a clay smokehouse. Um, so we can start to cure some of the meats. Smoking meats. Sweet Baby Ray's goes well on smoked meats. That is going on the ribs. Sweet Baby Ray's. Sweet Baby Ray's. Do Sweet Baby Ray's. Sweet Baby Ray's is very good. I don't think I'm ever going to get tired of that video. So, remember to take off your barley so you don't use your barley. And uh, because I've moved that now, I can delete this campfire. It's 3 in the morning. He didn't get any sleep. It's more dull night. Oops. Uh, I know how that goes. I really cannot, I really cannot wait to play. Uh, Stranded Alien Dawn with the, the new military outposts uh, DLC. That's going to be so amazing. Um, uh, we've got goats. That's great. So now what can't be in the stockpile? I need to get the cloth off the stockpile next. Um, and and uh, my herbs. You can actually haul the herbs to the shelf. Perfect. Perfect. We're Doing real good here, and dude, just put that on a shelf, please. Yes, okay. Things are things are coming together now. Um, I remember there being some seeds laying out in the sun here. Yeah, so let's have her 
bring those seeds in and those seeds I'll get Oscar to grab so I'll harvest those uh, Oscar stop cutting trees Gotta keep it organized, right? And everything everything happens sort of in a, a procedural way. Okay, you guys actually need to mine around the edges so we can get more shelter. The hay decays too. It didn't used to. Hay used to not decay, but they made hay decay. So I gotta create a hay silo pretty soon. Okay, so we're gonna clear that. And this one's actually gonna be a textile shelf. And this one's gonna be a food shelf. And we'll go from there. Uh, make sure I turn off textiles. Okay, now this is uh, this is really starting to clip along here. I need to get the stone up and out. Yeah, it's, this is going to be a facile stone building. Um, there's no, there's no, no shortage of stone as we excavate. No shortage of stone. The entire, uh, the entire structure is built on. Where exactly is the map edge here? Just trying to visualize the final build. Yeah, I can see it. It'll be cool. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do my best to make a, a proper concentric castle. Probably actually cancel that door so I can move the stone out of the way in the morning. Are we doing a research? Only three books.
do a, we'll do a haul day and bring in all this wood and whatever else is out here. Probably actually put her on harvesting, shouldn't I? First harvesting and cooking and then research. Probably going to be another attack, but I reckon we'll get a new community member first. Um, probably around day four or something. Usually there's, uh, usually there's an attack in the first summer. Yeah, so far so good. Okay, these are flowering now, that's good. When's my barley up? Barley's up in five days. So barley is going to come up too late in the season, I think, to replant more. Are these... I uh, know they're not ripe yet. How are we doing on the... Why aren't they bringing in herb seeds? I guess there's no shelf for seeds. No, I don't, uh, god damn it. Seeds minus saplings, please. Hmm. Place another shelf then. Also, I guess I could place, start with uh, weapon racks. Just out here, there's three weapon racks. They brought in any lumber yet? No, they haven't brought in any wood yet. Their, their hall priorities are fucked. Wood should be the first thing they bring in. It's the most necessary commodity, and you always... Yeah, I guess for the priority, maybe. Priority very high. Let's try that. Because you always wind up with just piles of wood out in the fields. And, like, they're bringing in fucking saplings before they're bringing in, like, the lumber that you need to just do anything. Super, super frustrating stuff. What's this stuff? Is this flax? Oh, that's flax. All right, let's, uh, let's harvest the flax. There's a lot of it. Yeah, I've got wood all over the place. Just need it in storage.
the indoor temperature down here. It's good. What's Catherine doing? Harvesting. Is there even clay on this map? I didn't see any. To build the smokehouse. I don't, yeah, I don't know where clay comes from. This is not. I mean, there must, there must be clay in the mountain lair, but if it's out there, it's a uh, super small, super small patch. Check over here somewhere. No, I don't see. I don't see any clay. Um, if you if you know where to get clay on the mountain layer so that I can build a smokehouse, I would appreciate it. Because I I have I have no good goddamn idea. I'll probably Google that after. Okay. Flowering. Fifty percent flowered. Or, sorry, thirty to forty percent flowered. Everyone's starving again? No, just one person. Why is Oscar starving? He's stuck somewhere? No. Stupid. Hungry. How about starving? What goes on that shelf? Not seeds, not medicine, not food. And they're pretty aggressive about hauling <laughs> those, those saplings around. That is obnoxious. Research is available. Okay, so now we're getting, uh, we're at 15, so I need, what do I need? Got food preserving. I'm going to need to get uh, smelting next so we can get some iron production going to make some iron doors so that the enemy can't batter through my doors. Oh, I guess this is fine. This is a fine balance. Um, I, I might have some. I really need seed storage, I guess. That's way more important than... Can't turn off all the saplings. Might as well just put the saplings on the main stockpile anyway. Okay, good. We've got weapons in the racks now, so the weapons aren't decaying. Um, mechanical components can stay there. Vinegar doesn't seem to go bad. I guess I'll move the butcher table underground too in a, in a second here. Go to bed, dude. Just go to bed.
I really should build a second, uh, second religious shrine for them now, shouldn't I? We're gonna need, <laughs> we're gonna need to make indoor space soon, um, or else they're gonna freeze their, freeze their asses off when, but that way they can, they can all pray. Because there's four of them, they're all restitutionists, and only two can use the shrine at once. I'll be happier if I meet their religious needs. Okay, still researching. This is going better. I didn't go so far as to say this is going great. Uh, except we're running out of food again. Means uh, hunting. And let's look for uh, animals who are... I really don't care. I, we can hunt all the goats for all I care. Because I'm, I'm raising goats, so I don't need more goats. We can extirpate the goats. And they, 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 they do come back. It's not really like you. Actually, why I put all the goats, you just... It hurts the population there. He's off the hunt right now. Perfect. That'll solve the food problem permanently if I just get a bunch of meat and store it in the cold storage. Going to need some more shelving. Um, Andrew could do mining now, I guess, again. Construction, hauling. Where are we at with our... I'm starting to get sick of waiting for this stuff to go to seed, but... Whatever. It'll all get harvested roughly the same time. It'll be a midsummer harvest, I guess, and then one last fall haul of cabbages. It'll be good though. I think I think we're gonna, we're gonna flourish here. Pretty sure. Okay, again. Parameter first. I'm going to need to mine some iron to do that probably sooner rather than later. I could also mine some, some gold uh, before a merchant shows up and makes some gold bars. That might be a good idea. Oh, that's what I haven't done. Uh, let's just drop a merchant to merchant stall somewhere like there. That's good. I'm gonna put the pyre somewhere, but right now I'm just throwing bodies on a stockpile. Nothing else I need to build. The table would make them happy, but I need more indoor space. Okay, hunger comes calling. Hankin. Call him Hank for short. Um, he just wants in. Let me in. Let me in. Uh, he's a reckless aerosmith. Um, who does have a marksman skill. Um, he's also a miner. That's fantastic. But he's a he's a member of the Oak Brethren sect. Um, which means his religious needs are not going to be met for quite some time. I'm I'm not doing Oak Brethren stuff in a community with four restitutionists. Uh, maybe maybe we can convert him. I think there's a conversion mechanic um, now. I'm not I'm not quite sure how that works. Medicine. Um, he has a passion for construction, but he fucking sucks at it. I know guys like that. Um, Alright, welcome aboard, Hank. Let's see what his actual skills are. <laughs> Passion for marksmanship, but he also sucks at it. He's got a mining of 17, so I'm just going to put him on mining right now. And that's all he does for us, is he mines. The, the baldy. Alright. Ah, that facial hair isn't in the the list of facial hairs you can pick from. I wonder if there's a mod that unlocks all the, the hidden facial hair. Okay. So that means Andrew can come off mining and uh, focus on construction and hauling. In that order. Hank does have a melee of seven, so I'll give him uh, the Bardiche there. Ooh, all this 
barley. All that barley. I didn't even... Okay, maybe... Maybe she should be foraging. Because that's some pretty goods. Who's on hauling right now? Kevin's on hauling. It's also on hunting. Yeah, we've got we've got meat and food and not enough beds and settlers are starving. Okay. Let's just drop another bed down. He's gonna have to build his own bed. And you know, she actually needs to cook first before harvesting. That's just the grim reality of the situation. Oscar is rebellious now. What's making him unhappy? It's the food situation. And the being deprived of religious activity. Okay. Okay, well, these, these these are things we can solve. They should not be deprived of religious activities. That's for damn sure. Okay. I'm actually going to start a second room over here. Four, five, six, seven, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The middle pillar for now. Research available. Okay, we're getting there. Needs to research another five. Oh god, I almost screwed up. Manage. Uh, god, if he ate barley. <laughs> and they do. They think that's the first thing they go for. They're like, mmm, barley. Like, there's other things you could eat. There's cooked foods you could eat, but they, they prioritize eating the thing that the game knows you need. Um, okay, what else did I need to do here? Uh, their daily schedule, I can give them back. Uh, midday break. Actually, I haven't checked with Hankins. Uh, he's a swigger. He's an animal handling uh, master. He's dumb. He's hot-blooded. And he uh, is really, really eager to kill people. Okay. Well, those all seem like useful traits, except that that the being brain dead thing. He is good at mining, though. That's this is just. Wow, we have a lot of limestone now. Okay, I'm gonna need to start planting trees too, so that we can. Although they, I mean, the forest seems to be rebounding almost on its own. Like I'm, we don't even have all the wood in. Is there any wood in yet? No, no. <laughs> they just they never haul wood. They never ever ever haul wood. I don't know how to to like individually click on stacks. I guess some goat leather there. It's a goat corpse. She needs to prioritize that. Might as well get Hank an arm, just in case. Flimsy Bardiche.
more shelves are needed. Good, he'll build them. This room's probably gonna get a little bigger, to be honest. I'll move the shelves around again. Now we're now we're really Yeah, we're halfway through summer. How's my uh, crop coming along here? Harvest is just around the corner. If your barley comes up before summer day five, you can get two crops out. But uh, if I plant on day seven, it won't be mature by the time um, the winter uh, frost hits. And it hits a little early, right? It gets cold in late fall, so... You don't, uh, you don't want to mess around with that and lose a crop of barley early. And she'll only cook until we have 25 foodstuffs, which means that there's going to be, uh, at, at a certain point, a window of opportunity for her to transition back to research. Although I could, I could convince Osgar to go do research now, couldn't I? He doesn't need to be harvesting or cutting plants. like him to continue hauling but he's these are these are long haul distances right that's cats out there hanging out with the wolves that doesn't seem like a good idea now does it Do I not have shelves for material? I'm pretty sure I do. I do. They're just not hauling. That's fine. Oh, I have I managed to bring in some more barley. That's good. So barley I won't use in the first year at all. Um I, I just keep it on the shelf so it doesn't decay. You try to stockpile it, get up to like 30 or 40 barley. Um, because you want you want fields of barley uh as much and as often as you can because it's hay. And that feeds the animals, and the animals are are really the uh, you know food source. And turn your vegetables and your hay into animal feed. But the animals produce meat, which feeds your community much much more efficiently.
move this indoors now, couldn't I? And then we would take the uh, carcasses completely off and put a stockpile in the basement here that is just carcasses. Start copy pasting these. Might as well put the door on now. I don't know who's designed to build that, but someone better. Okay. We have enough food now. So she should theoretically be on research. Oh, she's on harvesting because the the cabbages came up. Got it. Okay, this makes this makes sense. And then she'll go to research. It might be a little late in the season. Um, whatever, whatever. I need him to start getting iron. We'll work on that room later. Has Osgar hauled a single piece of wood in all that time? No, of course he has. Boxy, Box, I'll fix the wood hauling situation, please. Just allow, like, allow us to prioritize what gets hauled. Like, if I want wood in my community, like, it's such an important resource. And to have the settlers go out in the field a really long way into the forest every time to get the wood that's laying around, which decomposes too out there, like, it, you know. There's a lot of optimizations that have been done in this game. A lot of a lot of good optimizations. Um, but that that would that would is just infuriating. I'll get her researching anyway.
That's why he can't build it, because there's stuff in the way. We need to clear area first. He needs to clear the area of the thing. This is bad logic too. Okay. Have Andrew all this thing. Oh, he's wandered off on me? Yes. God damn, that's obnoxious. Now let's have him install the thing. Is the cat going to get in the way now? Is this... Alright. Undraft him. There we go. God damn. God damn. Alright. Um... That's better. This is this is gonna be a kitchen, I think. In the in the end, uh, I'll turn into a not in the end, rather, but in the next phase, which we're drawing close to the end of the stream here, another couple minutes. But uh, don't think don't think we're getting attacked. If it's gonna happen, it's gonna happen today. Make sure we ticked. Don't sow on the barley so they don't automatically re sow the barley. I hate when that happens. It's getting on in the season. Um, I'm going to need to start thinking about winter clothing. Let me just see who's wearing what. Um, yeah, so winter clothes are starting to decay on these folks. Uh, for some reason, I can't see Hank's attire or Oscar's attire. Let's see. Can I see their attire this way? Yes. Yeah, and Hank's clothes are winter clothes. So everyone's winter clothes are going to decay before the end of the winter. Um, so I'm going to need to make five, probably six, because we'll get one more joiner, I would imagine. Um, five or six sets of clothes. That's a research situation. Okay, we can research smelting now. Um, it should allow me to construct... The furnace, I'll make a stone furnace because we have just an incomprehensible amount of it. And we'll put uh, two, we'll put two furnaces there. And then Andrew can start smithing. And we'll make some iron. We'll turn the iron into reinforced doors. That'll be, at the beginning of the next session, we'll be replacing these doors, the reinforced doors, so when the enemy shows up, they have, like, so much HP to chew through. Um... And then we can, you know, once once that's done, that's when the like that's when the actual gameplay starts. Like you've got you got like hard access control, you've got iron production. Um, next, we'll be tailoring, making the winter clothes, um, and then we pretty much just need to survive our first winter. Okay, let's make iron until we have how much is a door? Sixty iron. A door is I think thirty or twenty. So, three doors worth of iron at any given time. You, you don't need an excessive amount. Like, I don't want him smelting constantly and incessantly, but um, let's do that. Smithing two, hauling three. What's Hank's construction skill? 
zero, but apparently he can, he can build it. He's probably going to fail at it, but he can build it. What else do I have? I probably have a little... No, no silver or gold yet. Okay, so... Just set it up to also smelt iron until we have 60. And, uh... He doesn't have... He's got, he's got a reasonable smithing skill. The 12. Okay, uh, let's get Kevin back on animal husbandry, off hunting, and hauling two. Those hauling to five, he probably has more important things he could be doing. No, no, I guess that makes sense. He's no better or worse at any of these other things than anybody else, so. There, now he'll, he'll go, he'll milk the goats. We can get a fermenting table and we make cheeses. Like that's that's good. I noticed there was a mod um, that adds different room types. Adds a whole bunch of different room types, including like a, um like a dairy, right? So that looked interesting. I haven't I haven't really experimented with any of the mods. I'd I'd, I'd like to see some total conversion mods for this. I I sure would. Some like um, dark age or or um, a bronze Age. A bronze Age would be awesome. <laughs> uh, the merchants, the, the, you know, he comes and uh, you sell him some low-quality copper, like Anasir. These are stone with the copper veneer. I've been bamboozled by Anasir. Um, if you're in the we pretend it's a bronze, bronze Age internet meme group, you get that you get that tedious meme, but. Okay, good. And both and both furnaces are clipping away. This is this is good. So we're gonna have um iron very, very soon. Um we're almost to defensive structures. Probably won't happen before the next raid. Um but but I've been doing this for an hour and ten minutes and uh and I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna call it there, um, drop a save and pick up um on another day. So um, that is, in fact, all for me for now. Uh, this has been Postmodern Cowboy playing Going Medieval, a community management survival building game from Foxy Voxel. Um, if you uh, like watching me play games, let me know what you think down in the comments. Uh, subscribe to my channel, throw me a like on YouTube, tell your friends about this game um, and, and about my, uh, my videos. Um, and stay tuned. I'm going to do some, uh, some political content. I'm still working on the leaker video. It's taken uh, more time than I thought. Um, but yeah, thanks so much. Uh, keep it peaceful out there.